Welcome, my name is Bert Arnauts. Don't take small steps, take a giant leap. Welcome to this series of videos where we will explain you what we do and why we do it here at Nubera. So in this first video, I want to explain you some concepts. Some concepts around infrastructure automation, because that is what we've been doing for the past five years. Historically coming from infrastructure as service projects, where typically self-service portals get implemented to automate a series of events from deploying machines to updating machines and so on and so forward. Today, however, we do see more and more customers moving towards an infrastructure as code uh, in, uh, type of infrastructure, where the trigger for the automation flow, I would say, comes from a code push instead of a request from some kind of portal. And this infrastructure as code base, I would say, will enable us to go further towards more a self-healing, uh, an event-driven kind of infrastructure. So these are the things we will talk about in the upcoming, upcoming videos. Um, in the next video, we will go into detail in where all the magic happens. And the magic happens in the centralized tool chain. So if we want to talk about infrastructure as code, we will talk about stuff like version control, repository management, secret management, identity and access management, centralized metric collection, logging and automated testing, all this kind of good stuff we want to explain you in upcoming videos. So next video will be more going in depth or first high level on the centralized tool chain before we can go in depth on each individual topic. Only thing that rests me for this video is to thank you for watching this. But what is really important, I want to hear your comments. I want to hear your ideas on what kind of use cases you want to see. What kind of demos do you want to see? So I'm really, really curious to hear uh, more about that. Thank you for now and goodbye.